does searing a steak actually matter that much when it comes to overall flavor and texture? For a ton of people, a good sear is the number one most important thing that matters. I'll be comparing this A5 Wagyu steak that I stick straight in a low temp oven without searing it at all to a beautifully seared but unevenly overcooked steak. I want to see if the sear matters as much if it comes at the cost of moisture slash juiciness of the steak. Both steaks were salted beforehand, so no unfair advantage there. The first steak went right into a 275 degree oven until medium rare. And this other steak, I'll cook it like normal. I'll sear it for four minutes on one side and then three minutes on the other to get the best sear that I can. If you're at home, just stick to reverse sear. It's more or less the easiest and best way to cook steak. The seared steak definitely tastes steakier, but not by much because the other steak is still made out of A5 Wagyu. It is considerably less juicy, which affects the flavor big time. So next time you're cooking a steak and your grandma's talking shit, just keep in mind that a perfect sear isn't everything.